If you've ever wondered what the difference is between a semi-automatic shotgun that's gas operated and a semi-automatic shotgun that's recoil operated, we're about to go talk to Jared, our shotgun expert here at Elk Castle Shooting Sports, and get some insight on that. Well, Jared, I wanted to give you an opportunity to dispense a little more of your shotgun wisdom. So talk to me a little bit about semi-automatic shotguns, uh, the difference between an inertia recoil system and a gas operated system. Sure, now. Uh, we've got two different systems here. In this Benelli here, where you've got your inertia system. They're well known for that. It's a smooth actioning bolt, very lightweight. Um, you can shoot them all day, different types of uh, shotgun cartridge loads in them. Uh, it does have an inertia system coming down into the stock. If you actually notice, if you'll tap on the butt end of that stock a couple times, you can physically see that, uh, that bolt moving back and forth because of the, the movement that you're hitting the stock. It's actually transitioning the bolt back and forth using that inertia spring. Now, if you want to key, if you want to go further, we've got the Beretta here, which is they're known for their gas operation. A little bit heavier in design, just because it's got more moving parts. It uses the gas uh, gas operation um, from the expanding gas is going through the barrel, and what it's going to do is going to use that to cycle the the bolt in there. And you've got the, the exhaust port right here that is going to expel any unused gases that is not necessarily used for cycling the bolt. But generally, because they are a little bit heavier, it's going to reduce a little bit more felt recoil. So, so what are some of the pros and cons between the two? Well, like I said, the Benelli is going to be a little bit lighter. Uh, you can, If you're going to be doing a lot of movement, say a uh, sporting clay trap tournament, something like that, um, the Benelli is, is personally my choice because you can shoot it all day and it's, it's very comfortable. Now, um, if you were going to be in a more stationary position or you need something, you're going to be shooting a heavier load or something, the, uh, the Beretta is, is an excellent opportunity to uh, be able to reduce some of that recoil. It's going to be a little bit heavier, but there again, it's, it's going to be a little more sturdy for a proper swing plane and more consistent swing plane. Well, thank you, Jared. I feel like I'm up to speed now. You're very welcome. So now you know the difference between an inertia and a gas-operated semi-automatic shotgun. If you have any more confusion over shotguns or any other gun topic, come check us out at Elk Castle Shooting Sports. Look us up online at elkcastle.com and don't forget to sign up for our email updates.